121 to 106 victory over the Charlotte Hornets. Let's take a listen to the highlights as to how this one all played out. Nick's a little shorthanded tonight. No Julius Randle. He sits again. Sits again with the quad. Hi everyone. Mitchell it's Robinson also sidelined with lower back soreness. However. Randall's replacement in the starting lineup. Obi Toppin didn't take long to get the Knicks off and running. Knicks with the steal. Quickly the other way in the left-handed slam for Obi Toppin. I liked it. I liked it. Toppin got that dunk. No doubt about it. That also helps the field goal percentage. Knicks shooting the ball very, very well from the floor early on. Six of eight. How about 10 of the first 15 points in the paint? High percentage shots for the basketball team. And more importantly, they were going in. Jericho Sims getting his first start with Mitchell Robinson sidelined, and he got in on the act early as well. Manuel quickly looks for an opening. Lobs it inside for Sims, who slams it home. So the Knicks had themselves a seven-point lead. They would increase that lead to 12 at 28 to 16 after going on a 17 to 5 run and shooting the ball extremely well. How about 11 of their first 15? They were able to convert, but towards the end of the first quarter, with seconds winding down off the clock, the Knicks would end up cashing in from long range, and it would be one of the least expected shooters. Out by the midcourt line, now dribbles left side, looks to find an opening. Taj Gibson is open from downtown, and he rattles it in with three-tenths of a second remaining. How about Taj Gibson with a quarter three or a corner three?